Hello and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy on the PS5. My name is Romeo Chaos and I hope you're having a, a lovely evening. Um, right, what are we doing? Okay, yes. Uh, ah, we have to do Prisoner of Love. don't have a Lohamora yet, do we? Don't think so. Do we have a Lohamora yet? No. That's the last essential one that's locked. Yeah, I'm going to follow a guide when we get that, though. Which, we should get that today as well. Um... Uh, You know what? Oh, do I not have mold? Oh. Do I not have... <gasps> Wait, I don't have mold for yet, do I? Lumos. Uh, let's just do this. Hmm. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, we've got a field guide page in here as well. I'll come and quickly get that. Oh, wait, what am I doing? That's the one I Rebellion. want. Oh wait, have I not noticed those on the ends of the tables before? Huh. I've played this game several times on PC and I'm yet to notice these. Hmm. Better take the observant out of my CV. Uh, right. Whee! What are you doing, Peeves? may be able to help you, if only you'd stop to speak with me. You wanted to see me, sir? Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself. My boy. So few students know who I am these days. That's Eldridge Diggory, former minister for magic and founder of the Aura Recruitment Program at your service. I believe you can help solve a decades old murder, thanks to that book you found, and, in particular, its missing pages. How do you know about the book and the pages? We portraits here more than you might suspect, and most of us can keep a secret. Mm. So, what say you? Surely a Hufflepuff such as yourself would be inclined to help seek long overdue justice. Of course. I'll do whatever I can. Wonderful. I am pleased to have been right about you. My great niece, Helen Thistlewood, can provide you with details. She's retired now, but was a skilled aura in her day. And the unsolved murder of which I speak was her case. I often visit my portrait in her home, in the nearby hamlet of Upper Hogsfield. Shall I tell her to expect you? How could a few pages of a book help her solve an old case? A boy disappeared with those pages, but they never found the body. A girl was convicted of his murder, nonetheless. It seems those pages could exonerate her somehow. Yeah, the Hufflepuff one is so more. cool. You get to visit Azkaban. 
Can you tell me more gonna gonna about your great niece? Cream of the crop when it comes to auras. A star pupil here, and then an exemplary servant to the ministry. And her spark hasn't diminished one bit in her retirement. Oh, she and I often chat about old cases and our glory days. No offense, but That's it's good. nice to get away from the students and converse with someone who's familiar with my legacy. Fair enough. When were you the Minister for Magic? Over a hundred years ago. 1733 ah. to 1747, to be precise. Ah, the cool. Stories I could tell you. Oh, cool dates. Didn't have a chance to do all that I could. I was in the midst of reforming Azkaban when my life was cut short by dragon Ooh. pox. Azkaban. I was sneezing sparks to the bitter end. I shall go and see her right away. Brilliant. With what I suspect is your knack for hard work and her keen mind, both mysteries may be solved sooner than you think. I shall see you there. Soon, I hope. Nice. So, uh, Professor Weasley, I've gone out and don't wait up. Who's that there? Oh, you. Don't know who you are. Oops. Man, is it like nighttime or something? Because all that is quiet. Oh, hello, Zenobia. Oh, what, I can't fly here? Wait, why can't I fly? Have I unlocked brooms yet? Am I just confusing myself? Ah, that's why I can't fly. Okay then, uh, map. A uh, world map. Let's go to Hogsmeade, and we'll go from there. How have I not unlocked that flu flame? Well, I don't know. No one seems to be talking, and there's like no music. That's what I wanted. And can we get our flying lesson? Have we done our flying lesson? Can I buy a broom? Or am I just trying to wait for a broom? Quests. What have we done? <clears throat> no, okay. I don't see the flying lesson in there. Right. Oh man, right. 
lived here, I wonder. What have you done? Incendio. Levioso. Akio. It isn't. One less poacher in the wizarding world. Open that up. Go to Quidditch goggles. Take that money and let's go. This must what be the doing? place Minister Diggory mentioned. Helen lives around here somewhere. Ah, here you are. I'm pleased to see you took my advice. Madam Thistlewood, I met your great uncle in his portrait in my common room. He sent me to speak to you. You came. Uncle Eldridge believes the book you found and its missing pages may be relevant to an unsolved case from my time as an aura. Very well. I'm listening. Decades ago, a student named Richard Jackdaw disappeared after going to meet a girl named Anne. They never found his body. When his headless ghost appeared briefly in Hogsmeade, wholly unaware of how he died, Anne was convicted of his murder and sent to Azkaban. It was in large part due to the testimony of a girl called Apollonia Black. Jealous of Anne, I think. That sounds terrible, but I'm not sure how I can help. Anne's alibi was somewhat labyrinthine. She said Jackdaw promised her adventure following a map he found on some pages he'd stolen mm. from Peeves. And you think Peeves ripped those pages from the book I found in the restricted section? If my great uncle is to be believed, yes. At least, that's what the portraits at Hogwarts suspect. Anne insisted that Jackdaw had asked her to follow the map with him, but only after she solved a series of puzzles he'd prepared. Odd way to woo a girl. She swears she never even solved the first puzzle, so they didn't meet. Jackdaw's ghost vanished almost as soon as he appeared. Without Jackdaw's puzzle, pages, or remains, Anne was sent to Azkaban based solely on Apollonia's spurious testimony. I don't understand. What can I do to help? I believe Anne may have solved the first puzzle by now, but after spending time in Azkaban, she's a shadow of her former self. She won't speak to Ooh, anyone she doesn't Azkaban. trust, and she trusts no one. If you, a student with a connection to the pages, like Jackdaw had, spoke to Anne, she might reveal new information. What a horrible story. If you think I can help, I'll come with you. This is wonderful news. You are to be commended for your kindness and bravery. Fortunately, being a retired aura has its benefits. We can apparate right to her. I've escorted ministers, professors, and many others to that blasted place. Never a student, I'll admit, but I will keep you safe. Can you tell me more about Apollonia Black? Wretched, vindictive girl, that one. Apollonia claimed that Anne threatened to kill the boy after he broke her heart. The Black family's That's powering her over certain people in the ministry, along with the fact that Anne is muggle-born, sealed her fate. That's even worse. I'd like to know more about Anne. That poor soul never was the brightest girl, and that lack of wit proved to be her undoing. I half suspect Jack Dorn and Apollonia were merely toying with her. Who could have known he'd end up dead? She's not held up well in Azkaban. In some ways, she blames me for not proving her innocence. I'd like to clear her name if we can. You Let's said Jackdaw's ghost appeared briefly, then vanished. Where do you think he went? I have no idea. 
Evidently, he was always a bit restless, going on and on about adventure. If I had to guess, he tired of Scotland and is somewhere on the other side of the globe by now. Very well. Cool. Let's, Let's go. go. Steady yourself. We'll apparate together. Don't worry. I've never splinched anyone. Do Ooh, take care, good. though. And tread lightly in that horrible place. We'll be there in but a moment. Ought to keep them at bay for now. Though, be aware, you may feel a wave of despair. It will pass. Thank you for the warning. I always this have feeling of despair. Place, this is nothing new. But we'll be out of here soon enough. Now follow me. This isn't a place for loitering. I never thought I'd see the inside of Azkaban for myself. Nasty dementors. Not even I could convince the Ministry to send them off. There's no need for such monsters. Careful around, Anne. She's been here a lot longer than the rest of us. If I had my wand, I'd cast Brutio on the lot of you. Well, you're pleasant. You Oops. don't scare me, young cub. I teach you so little of what you should know of, Wards. That witch you're with has a dark cloud over her. I can feel it. What is that I hear? Perhaps death in all its mercy. Oh, approaches! No one at school's going to believe this. Now remember, Anne has been here a long time. The Dementors aren't kind. Have patience and speak to her quietly and respectfully. Oh, I can do that. Are you Anne? Who's there? Who speaks to me? Is that death finally come for me? I'm a student from Hogwarts. I found the book that you said would exonerate you. Ah, the book, the book. No one would look. None of the mages found the pages. Me hey, thinks the feckless right. knave meandered to his cave. My fate was surely sealed in Upper Hockey Field. Are you saying that the missing pages are in a cave near Upper Hogsfield? Hogs, Hogs, Field, Field, ruins house, a vault concealed. A vault in some ruins near Upper Hogsfield. I suppose it can't hurt to look. Can't hurt to look. Can't hurt to look. Go find the pages from your book. Helen. Helen. No, you're here. Come in closer. Be a dear. Hmm. What is it, Anne? <gasps> You have what you need. Uh, I'll be all right once I get... I'm gonna assume she's gone to St. Mungo's. But, Madam Thistlewood, I... All right. I'll find it. I'll find Jackdaw's cave. Mm. This looks intriguing.
Right. Incendio. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Mm. This must be the place Anne told me about. No one's been here for ages. What gave that away? The fact that it looks abandoned? Incendio. Accio. Totally didn't even see if I have enough gear slots on me. Please tell me I do. Oh, four left. I'm sure we'll be okay. I'm sure of it. <laughs> You'll not outfox me, Jackdaw. You couldn't outwit me, Jackdaw. Now, where's the clue you left behind? Anything else in here? Apart from breaking pots. My dearest Anne, well done. You've solved my puzzle. I knew you were a kindred spirit, and the only one with whom I could truly share my adventures. Meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest as soon as you can, and I will show you the map that I mentioned. There is no telling where it will lead us. I found it on pages that Peeves ripped from a secret book, and no one else seems to be able to find. I haven't any idea what lies ahead. But I am glad to know I shall share my future with you. This is only the beginning. Richard. P.S. I am terribly glad you found this, as I would have gone on alone if you did not. And what fun would that be? A hmm. note from Jackdaw. Anne never found it. So how did he die? Was she to blame at all? Right. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Oh. Could it be? Has someone solved my puzzle after all these years? Well done indeed. Richard Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw? 
I heard you disappeared years ago. You have some explaining to do. I do? That was my puzzle you solved. What are you doing here? A retired aura, Helen Thistlewood, told me about a map you stole from Peeves. And then Anne told me about a cave. You saw Anne? Broke my heart. I had to go on without her. Probably best for her in the end. Dare I ask? How is she? Uh, she's in Azkaban. Pretty much tortured. I think death would have been preferable. She was imprisoned in Azkaban for your murder. I fear the Dementors have taken an irreversible toll on her. What? Azkaban? Oh, poor Anne. I had no idea. I thought she'd written me off. I've been traveling the world for years to mend my broken heart. I came back here only recently. On a whim. I must well, speak to the aura then. you mentioned and see how I can help Anne. I'm glad to hear it. Before you go, would I still be able to find the pages with the map Helen mentioned? I'm almost certain I dropped them in the cave the moment I was beheaded. They're bound to be mouldering away with the rest of me. Tell you what, meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you precisely where to find them. If you don't mind me asking, how did you lose your head? I was having a look about when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze, after which I felt, well, light-headed. Uh. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do find yourself in a cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for, specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Helen mentioned Apollonia Black. Did she set up Anne to take the fall? Have you never met any members of the Black family? They can be rather... vindictive. Once Anne showed an interest in me, Apollonia couldn't let it alone. That her own heart had grown cold simply didn't matter. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor, whatever's likely to cause the most chaos. Found them on the floor outside the library where he discarded them. Not my luckiest find, all things considered. Ah, uh, not really, no. Thank you. I need to find those pages to help a friend. I shall see you there. Cool. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. You've, you've mentioned that move already. You, you, you mentioned that. Man, I wish we had a... No, I didn't mean that. Ooh, actually, do you know what we'll do? We'll stop off in Hogsmeade. Uh, so we can... Oh, sorry, excuse me. Uh, we'll stop off in Hogsmeade so we can uh, sell some stuff. And make sure we have plenty of room. Um, let's go to Times and Scrolls, why not? Ah, it's always nice to see a familiar face. Cool. Uh, can you buy this stuff off me, mate? A pleasure doing Ooh, business. Ooh, actually, that's supposedly better. Uh, sell that. Sell that. Sell that. I uh, will sell that as well. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. Let's 
didn't realize. Oh. Oh, that's probably something I had before, but I was too low level. And now I'm level 15, I can wear it. Mm. Uh, let's come here and let's do that. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Yes, let's. Oh, lovely. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. And not right now, mate. Anyone can run a shop if they inherited it. Maybe you complaining about love? You better not be complaining about Jay Pippins. Let's go as the crow flies. Here we go. Wait. Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It would take the patience of a Hufflepuff to track down these pages. Well said. Now, where do we go from here? Follow me. What's cool is he does actually say something like relating to all the houses. I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a bird bar. It's like patience of a up to find the pages. Intramuros. The uh, intelligence of a Ravenclaw. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention to be able to like solve the puzzles and stuff like that. Hmm. Like, aside from the, I think path, it's ambition. Anything of a else I should look for? Indeed, a few landmarks, a stone bridge, a waterfall, and if I recall, a and lake. And like bravery You'll of a see. Gryffindor to like brave the forest helpful. or something. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Is that Latin? Or Greek? Hmm. No idea, Richard Jackdaw. Um. So it's a little off. I just want to see what my sound settings are quickly. Ah, oh. maybe if I go to headphones, that will help. Mm. 
Oh, sorry, excuse me. Nothing to do now but keep going. Yep. The waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw surprisingly as good as his word. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. Mm. Mm. Oh, wait, it's just down that way. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. Ooh. Kind of looks like the PlayStation 2 like thing. <laughs> Aren't you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. <laughs> <laughs> Those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Dora's led me. I wonder how big this place is. I think there's like a chest up here. Oh wait, no, this is just the normal way back, okay. I thought it was a different path. Boom, boom, boom. Ooh. Impressive. That must be where all this leads. Thankfully, we don't have to, like, platform our way across. Like, we will fully repair Someone our bridge. Want casual visitors down here. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Expelliarmus! Protego! Stupify! Incendium! Incendium!
Oh man, right, there we go. Oh, there's a lot back there. But there's also a chest. I'm not gonna touch that, is it? I hope there were less spiders than jackdaws here. Ooh, an upgrade. I love an upgrade. I could summon that platform to me. I could likely get on it. Incendio. Ooh, lovely. Money. Ooh, money, money, money. Oh, there's nothing there. All right. No. Akio. That's worse, that would just be money. I suppose I'll just double check over here. Just make doubly sure there's like nothing. That's some dittany leaves, why not? Expelliarmus, 
Coming a bit more complete. Yeah, there's a few like offshoots, and there's always like a little bit somewhere. A little bit of treasure. Ooh, no. No, no. Just, just no for that. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Make sure. Accio. What? It's a good thing Jack Gordon didn't fall down there. An untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. I do apologize. All the like burping and coughing and that. So normally my throat gets so dry doing this. I mean that doesn't explain the burp, but incendio. Skeleton in sight. Hmm, but oh, I may as well find myself for this. Incendium. Expelliarmus. Protego. Just a big no. Oops. I didn't actually mean to do use that on both there. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Oh man. Akio. Let me use it. Accio. 
Expelliarmus, Incendio. Incendio. Stupefy. Expelliarmus. Stupefy. Man, I don't like spiders. Not like this, anyway. I mean, I don't, I'm not particularly fond of them, but... Yeah, wouldn't I like this? Definitely not. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. An untouched Ooh. chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. But that's good for us, though. Um, I think that's actually the way. So we'll go this way. Oh, man. Oh, hello. No, no, no. Ooh. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Oh, of course. Back here, of course. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign Ooh, of it. Oh, lovely some Wiccan World potions. I will happily take them. Wait, did I get that one? Yes, I did. I think I've got that one right. Yeah, I did. Okay. Yeah, I got that chest. Uh, there it is. The bridge, it's almost complete. More spiders. Oh, this can't man. be what bridge jacked. Did you guys really have to come out to play? No, oh, let's get rid of one of you.
incendio. Couldn't quite do that well. airborne one, but uh, oh well. Ooh, right. Ooh, a chest. I love a good chest. Untouched chest. Daredal wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. I love how we just roast. Like Richard Jackdaw. I love how we just roast him. I'll need to look around for the symbol. Lovely. difficult we are. I just want to make sure I'm not on like easy normal okay that's fine I mean I should have enough must be getting closer to Jack Doll's remains and those pages we meet again Richard Jack Doll. thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years here it is the Ooh. map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? Man. Expelliarmus! Bodega! Stupefy! Stupefy! Get out of the way! Yeah, unfortunately I got rid of my ancient magic before these guys came alive. That was uh, a mistake, but we do have a chest over here. I'm just going to uh, own money. Uh, if I bribe you, mate, does that work? So much better when we get the talents unlocked. Oh no, just, just no, 
just no, 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 no. Oh no, the room's starting to flood. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? This is cool. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What is this place? I don't know, but I did get some stuff and I kind of just want to... Oh, I definitely should have put those on. That would have helped a tiny bit. Uh, neckwear. Let's just go through some of this stuff. Oops. Oh, well, we've defeated like 30 spiders already. Lovely. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Hmm. Lovely. We found the map chamber. <clears throat> this is so cool. I love it. Can it be? Percival Rackham. It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from no, the No, I'm still lost. You're I'm Professor still searching Rackham. for it. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our... Ability no. to see traces of ancient magic. I, I don't see yes, that, sir, no. I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Ooh. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here.
Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. It I'm is. afraid we Some must pause our conversation until you return with the book. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Typical seer. Very well. I'll retrieve the book Just like right the centaurs. Away. Good. I saw we something. Shall speak again I once cannot the book be sure to what I saw, but I definitely saw something. And uh, what I saw... I keep pressing the wrong button. What I saw is not surprising. We have 11 talents. I always do stealth because... Man, it's good to do this. So we'll keep a couple there for sure. Uh, Incendio is a must. Uh, Levioso is good. Definitely for keeping some of the airborne enemy stuff. Uh, core. Unlock and unlock spell lock. Yes. This would have helped a great deal in what we just done. That reduces spell cooldowns. New spell set. Oh, Wigan World Greater Effects. I think that. And I think we'll just go for that as well. We'll get all these. Uh, so that one, Protego, will fill our ancient magic meter. That's good. Yeah, so we've got a couple of spells. Man, I, I might leave the room of requirement ones alone this time. Like normally I get a couple in here. I might uh leave a couple from there and get a couple in the uh, Dark Arts one. Because uh, that might be good to get this time. Because I might get a few of these. I mean, I say a few of these. I'll get the... Um... I'll get the uh, unforgivable curses. Ooh, trophy end. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? I'm so glad they turned her down in the whole, like, you can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. It's like, Ugh. Get these chests. It was me, chest. You have been fooled. Ha 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 ha. Right. I 
I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he's Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Oh. There's a key here. Damn. You need to learn to pulso, the banishing charm. Useful for pushing objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks oh, nice. and meet me in my classroom. Alright, cool. Uh what else have we got? <gasps> Flying gloss. Oh yes. Focus potion max manageurus. Okay. We need to do the flying class so badly. Oh, that's only a plus one. Oh. Another key. Where are you going? Oh, I know where you go. Damn it. I was hoping that I could get it straight away. Oh. Okay. Come on. There we go. Revelio. Urn of Ashes. Oh, hello, Professor Beans. And uh, we've got the Sleeping Dragon one here as well. Sleeping Dragon statue. Secret door. Man, this is so cool. Don't think there's anything with these ones, though. I go through here. Here we go. Oh, wait, there's a page. How did I not get that one? Be able to get a broom. Everybody Begin. grab a broom and we shall get started. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver I love how I've met all these people already safely. and it's still just like, As hello, hello, like hello. This, first and foremost, a 
means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops <clears throat> will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Boo. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holiday. Yeah, that was like Gryffindor right For there. For those who need a refresher, step Lawrence up to your Davis. room. Say up, firmly and clearly. Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up. Thank you. Thank you. Now, your turn. Up, 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 you stupid ratty school broom. Hey, don't call it as up, stupid ratty school broom. Can't help it's broomness. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. If you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Good. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. The brooms <gasps> are school <gasps> property. I think I'm getting I the hang of this. I want them returned in one piece. Good grip. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a flight! Yes, it <gasps> is. That wasn't too bad. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. This is rather fun. I do agree. Well At the moment. Uh, for you, Mr. Clopton, no. <clears throat> I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Hufflepuff like you might be interested in some high-flying fun? Uh, no, because we do get in trouble. But also, there's no way that. to avoid it. What so, might as well. A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. It's like your choices really the don't matter for the most part in this game. In. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely and... Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Oh, I don't know what I'm flying like now. Way. Okay. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? <laughs> Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? There's the hotbox from our own windows. Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Ha -ha! Now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippogriff? 
No, I'm part of Thestral. There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the Owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Looks like she's already dismissed class. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Never Mr. Clopton, Clopton, I blame you. I'm disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that business with Kagawa, but you have to admit those views were worth it. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. <laughs> you seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. Oh, I will. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spint, which is in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. We actually were. If I could afford the new Bright Spark broom at Spint Witches, I'd be on it now. Good for you. Did I get that? I didn't get that one. Okay, let me go. Oh, I did get this one. Right, where is on? World map. Uh... Oh, why do I get the feeling he's like down here somewhere? Uh, I think he is. Okay, let's put a marker there and a fast travel here. I want to see Arn. Oh, now I've done the flying class. Hopefully I can purchase a broom from him. I've not forgotten about our library venture. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Good day to you. I require assistance with a delivery. I thought you might be interested. Please visit me at J. Pippin's Potions if you'd like to earn a few coins. Of course, someone's interested. Please meet me interested. in the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for yes. somewhere you can focus on your studies, away from prying eyes and distractions. It's the room of requirement. So good. I'm really going for a purchase, I really shouldn't. Incendio. Protego. Uh, I didn't mean is simply to too go many. invisible there. <laughs> didn't mean to do that. <laughs> oh well. Do you know what? We keep 
running further away. Let's just run down here. We'll go as the crow flies. I can't... I know he's around, like, this sort of area, I think. on on the map he's, I think he's just around here it might be around this bridge so I think if I go down here Where is on? Let me have a look. Let me find his location. Because I was pretty sure it was just like around there. I think he's just over this bridge. Okay. Ah, that's cool. Okay, I'm in the right place. I knew I was. Thought I was in the right place. He should be just over the bridge. Ooh. Lovely. Yes, there he is. Have a little peruse. Oh, what? Do I have to buy one of his ones first? Oh, what? I cannot you thank you enough me? for all you did to get my carts returned to me. I've been painting and painting. Incredible how such darkness can inspire such beauty. More than happy to purchase that. Good to have stock, I always say. Right, what we'll do. Is well, uh, 
appreciate you stopping by. Right. Be sure to visit me again, won't you? I will. I shall be back on. Uh, not Hogwarts map. Hogsmeade. That's what the one I wanted. Oh, I just got to buy one of his brooms first. Oh, that's annoying, man. I can't just go straight to Arn. That's kind of annoying. Right. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Right, I need I had to, to try one of your brooms, mate, so I can buy one from someone else. And I've only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare youth wheels available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. You said disrupted trade routes <laughs> caused you to close, Spint Witches. Terrible it's been. Trade routes reported as unusable. Evidently criminals were overtaking roads, threatening hamlets. I can fly safely almost anywhere. But you try flying with an inventory of brooms on your back. No easy feat. Right yes, then, 5, back to gold work. If a particular broom one, takes your fancy, just let me know. Which is a silver arrow. Uh, right. Do you mind sharing more about your brooms? I have a passion for them. Every detail of every model. Take wind wisps, well known for their quality ash handles. You weavers are rare because some fear flying them, likely to do with the U one's darker reputation. Then you have the Ember Dash, known for its handsome appearance. Working with brooms every day makes me practically giddy. It's one of many reasons I cherish running this shop. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. <laughs> what are we looking for today? Uh, not really any of these. Do you know what? Just for the fun of it, we'll buy this one. You'll be thrilled with that broom. I promise you. Nice doing business with you. Right. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancement? Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you! I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? I can't say fairer than that. How long have you had a passion for brooms? Since the moment I saw my first Quidditch match. Seeing flyers manoeuvre the way they do. Oh, some people continue to have their doubts about me and my ideas. I hope that won't dissuade you from helping. I know I'm onto something. Why do you need me to report to you on this broom flight? I did try to get Imelda to help, but she has some flying habits and quirks that made her difficult to collaborate with. I need a flyer with no bad habits and the knack for flying. <laughs> Your classmate Everett said you're a natural on a broom. 
He's forever in here studying the newest models, almost as passionate about brooms as I am. If your rumored talent for flying can help you beat Imelda's times, then having you assess the broom will be invaluable. Sounds as if you took Kagawa's class. I did, but my focus on the technical elements of brooms rather than the art of flying drove her mad. Mm, she thinks it's fitting enough. I run spin witches now. I don't reckon either of us ever pictured me batting away bludgers for the Cannons or Puddlemere United. And I find a certain satisfaction in winning over the naysayers who think I'm maybe too young to run this shop. With your help, I can continue proving myself the most knowledgeable purveyor of wizarding sporting goods around. That sounds well, intriguing. True. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while, if I'm right. The new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. But first I have to go see Goblin about a time, better broom. Be sure to let me know. Wait, I can just fast travel. World map. Right, I should be able. Yeah, if you fly close to the ground, you get unlimited, uh, like speed boost, which is cool. I cannot thank you enough for all you did oh, sorry, to get sorry. my carts returned. Well, I to still me. can't buy a broom. I've been painting and painting. Oh, do I have to finish? Incredible how. Such the time trial thing. Oh my such days. Beauty. Are you kidding me? Uh, right. I mean, I will buy all the brooms probably. I don't know how much I'll actually do with this in terms of completion. But, uh. I think if I do this, I'll be able to... Rebellion. Uh, if I do this, I should be able to get the other broom. Which will be nice. The upgrades are nice. I think you technically go faster with them. And it also allows you to not be so close to the ground to do the sprint. Hey you, Hufflepuff. 
Uh, the name is Chaos. Romeo of Chaos. Amelda Rays? I'll be weak sent me. <laughs> <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. I don't know what people have said, but I certainly wasn't showing off. Tell that to the rest of the school. But it doesn't matter. Everyone knows that class bum, is only bum, for beginners, bum. troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough uh, of this. I'm at Hogwarts. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the and fastest I can times on this do course. do magic. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus How Hufflepuff. could I be a useless squib? Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. Oh, watch me win, Imelda. Watch me win. Right, uh, I've... Did it! Right, here we go. Okay. Brilliant. This is rather fun. Oh, ah, uh, yep. No! Come off here! How did I miss that so badly? Made it! No! Come on! There we go! How am I doing so badly at this? How did I miss those? I flew like perfectly next to Success. them. Success. <laughs> okay. Oh, did anyone Even else with see the uh, time penalties, we still managed to do it. Yeah. Oh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. Oh. Fine. You won. Oh, don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Eh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. All right. Challenge cool. accepted then. Perhaps you have what it takes after all. We shall see. But don't get your hopes up. The next course near Irondale offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. There you are. The cross one's duelist to beat. Right, return to Albie Weeks. What's that? Follow the butterflies. Oh, that's a demanding delivery. Hey, man. <laughs> ba -da -ba -da -bum, ba -dum -ba -bum. Oh, 
you're back. We've something to report, I hope. Mr. Wheat. Yes, I can you allow me now to uh, broom. buy broom? Incredible. Miss Ray must else. have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Mm, that's precisely what I needed to know. Mm, drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Y even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. Well, that's good. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Nice. Hmm. How to address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? Bum, ba -da -bum, bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Good for you. I thought you were a scarecrow then. It's just your hat. Thank you enough for all you did Still to get my the parts returned to me. I've been painting and painting. Why can't I buy the broom? Incredible how such darkness can inspire such beauty. I still can't buy the broom. When can I buy the broom? Uh, be sure to visit me again, won't you? When can I buy the broom? I own my own broom now. I've done the flying class. I've done his test for the upgrade. Have a look. Silver arrow broom, simply elegant with of handle and quotation designed by a famous broom maker. Lower wholesale note that you need to complete the carted away side quest for Aunt to open up his shop. Yeah, it doesn't say I have to do anything else. So that should be available to me, but it's not. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let's do... Uh, let's do this one. I think that's the closest flame. Oh, it actually is.
Sebastian, hey, it's been a while. Out. It has. Popped into existence then. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment. In the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. This way. There's a secret passage just here. It's well disguised. Oh. How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play gobstones here all the time. With my sister. Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. Ravelli used to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. I think I've seen Ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. And I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special to him. Understood. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. Ominous cannot abide them, as he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the blasting curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. Ooh. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. Cool, let's do it this. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well. Oh, cool. So the name of the spell. That, that, that's good. The Pizarro. You're getting it. Ready to actually try it out? Stick to the targets, though. Best to keep the Undercroft intact. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses, but I think you'll find that a confringo. Nice work. How's it feel? It's a tad hot. That's it. I think I've got it. Well done. Cool. I have to say, 
I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. The blast does heat things up. <laughs> I see how you lost your eyebrows. <laughs> You'll get used to it. And Ominous and I used to practice down here for hours. The Undercroft was our retreat. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do... Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. She could use some cheering up. Just let me know when and I'll meet I'd you. I'd be glad oh, she misses Sebastian. Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. <laughs> I assume it's to do with what you told me. About the port key and Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past you. And yes, it is. As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening. You must promise to keep this between us. I trusted you with knowledge of this secret Undercroft. You can trust me. All right. I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient I'm chosen magic. one. I don't know what I was expecting to say, but it wasn't that. What does that even mean? Honestly, I'm not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours, does it allow you to wield this magic too? I... I don't know. Well, when you do know, tell me. I've been studying archaic forms of magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, I suspect a bit more time practicing the blasting curses in order. Spend as much time yep. here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. What if I run into Ominous? When I head to Like, Feldcroft, it makes no sense to keep it from him. If he knows about this place, like, he's blind, not stupid. Like, <laughs> he's gonna know if I'm down here or not. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. You there. I can hear you. Oh, hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? I stumbled that upon it. room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, didn't he? You breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster. I am not afraid to exploit that connection. I if mean, I tried I need not to. to tell you. Trust me, Ominous. I won't say a word. And Sebastian is a good friend. You shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant... I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. Mm. That's cool. Um, 
Right. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, it's just over two hours. Um, let me just see if I can buy this broom one more time. And I know it's only cosmetic, but I love the look of it. Peruse. No, okay. Still just no then. Appreciate your right, well. Uh, be sure to visit me again, won't you? We will go back to the castle. Uh Oh, uh, we'll come to the Astronomy Tower. I won't do this mission, I'll just sort of get next to it. By this tower. Uh, right. I think that's me done for tonight. Uh, yep, that's now saved. Right, that is me done for tonight now. Um, I hope you've had a lovely stream or video. Um, I will be back tomorrow. Uh, and I will be playing some... What's that? Uh, I'll be playing some Fallen Order. Uh, some more of that tomorrow. Um, I think we're visiting Kashyyyk, I think. Uh, on Fallen Order next, so that'd be fun. And, uh, yes. Um, like I said, I hope you've enjoyed the stream. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you've enjoyed uh, what you've seen. And, uh, yes, leave a comment as well uh, with potentially how what you've liked what games you'd like to see me play and uh yeah i think that is it for now otherwise i'm gonna start rambling and repeating myself about a hundred times so uh i shall see you next time bye bye now